Greetings everyone, and welcome back to Pep Organ. Well, we're nearly at the end of 2022, and I thought that I'd just take this video to reflect on the year and talk a little bit about what's going to be happening in the future, especially with regards to Pep Organ. It's been quite a year on the channel. Um, we've seen a, a, quite an extraordinary amount of growth in subscribe account, and we've been really grateful for that, um, Kim and I. Uh, it's, we started back in the year um, with the Pep Organ Composition Competition, and we were delighted to see those entries and uh, contribute some new music to the organ scene. We also had uh, a number of special occasions, uh, some performances and some organ tours. Uh, I was particularly proud of the tours we did at St. Mary's Cathedral and uh, Hunter Bailey Church, um, and those have seen us grow immensely, and I've been very, very grateful for all of the support that we've had with those videos. We also did some composition work. Um, I worked, I've composed a lot of work this year, including my biggest work to date, which was my organ symphony, which uh, if you haven't seen the video, I sadly didn't get through the full premiere of because the organ broke down. Ironically after that, then I suppose that I broke down because for the past few months, I've been uh, recovering from a form of tennis elbow. Just an update on that, I am getting better. Um, I'm able to play again um, to, to a more lengthy degree, though I'm still taking it very carefully and cautiously, and I, I probably won't be playing back to my full potential again until um, perhaps after January next year. Um, so that's part of one of the reasons why in recent weeks I haven't been able to upload as much as I would like to. But there's something more I'd like to talk about, because I think some of you may be wondering, after two years of Pep Organ, where we're going with the channel. And I, have, um, I do have some update to provide to you about that, and I, I, I'm not sure if it's, if it's news that you're going to like, but, um, well, how do I put this? Um, next year's Pep Organ videos are going to be much better much, much better, uh, but there's a reason for that, because we're going to be cutting out what we've been doing up to this point, which was the goal of one video per week. I have really liked this as a challenge to, to make sure that I'm constantly contributing to this channel and building it every single week. But what I've decided is that it doesn't really fit uh, for what my current goals are and where I want to be in the future, especially next year. The weekly video idea came from sort of inspiration from church because a lot of us every Sunday in a church service need to play a new postlude and so I thought of it as a sort of complementary way of practicing new repertoire and building up my repertoire and sharing it with you every all the time. So I thought that that was a good system but in recent times I've decided that I'd like to do things a little bit differently. I'm not going to have a designated upload schedule anymore, it's not going to be every Saturday. Instead, it's going to be more infrequent. But the good news for you is that, uh, as the viewer, is that it's actually going to be more content than you actually got in the past in Pep Organ. So I have big projects. I've already been working on a lot of projects behind the scenes, which I haven't shared with you. And it's partly because I haven't had time, because uh, there's always this weekly frantic um, need to upload, right? Um, a lot of us YouTubers get into this sort of addictive cycle of needing to upload and, and the sort of the battle that it takes to make the video, edit the video, all that work that goes on behind the scenes. Um, you can get away with uploading a lot more if you reduce the quality of your videos and you upload and don't do any editing. But I don't like that. I want, I want for my channel at least, to have really high quality videos every single week. And while we can deliver that every week, uh, it's not to the quality standard that I'd like to achieve going into the future. So. I don't want to spoil what we've got coming up, but basically uh, think more documentary type length videos. Uh, we're talking 20 or 30 minutes, uh, maybe even longer. And also uh, when we upload a piece of music, uh, rather than just playing the one piece, I'd actually rather play the full uh, work if it's a part of a multi-movement work. So if it's a sonata, then playing all three movements in one video or if it's um, something bigger, maybe my organ symphony, when I get to the point that I'm feeling up to it, I will record that whole thing, and that organ symphony goes for 35 minutes. So if you compare that just to a, a typical pep organ video, which is about maybe five minutes, a 35 minute video is going to be seven times as long, and it's going to be much more prepared because it's going to be a product that has taken weeks and weeks and maybe months of uh, work to produce. So what you'll be getting, even if the pep organ videos are being put out once a month, which I don't think it'll be that infrequent, but let's say that it is, you'll still receive more 
uh, to, to enjoy, more music to enjoy, more discussions than you did previously. So I'm actually very happy about this idea and, and this change. I'd like to hear what you think about it in the comments as well. Um, we're not stopping Pep Organ, everything's going to keep going just as it had before, but now I want to dedicate more of my time to more serious projects. And that means um, not just uh, these big works of organ music, which I've always wanted to tackle, but also um, more well-reasoned and thoughtful discussion that I have to actually go and research and, and do um, historical studies of. These are going to be questions about famous composers, um, discussions about the history of the organ, things like that. Um, there's a lot that I'd love to, to delve into, but if I was to actually do that on a weekly basis, I don't think it, the quality would be good enough to, to watch. Um, and I think that if I was to make it that my weekly challenge of doing videos in that style, it would take my entire week. And frankly, I don't have time just to do Hep Organ. I have a life outside of the YouTube channel, and um, there's a lot of music that I'm doing that you never get to see on the channel, like obviously the typical weddings and funerals and all those regular church events that I have to do. Um, that's all happening in the background. Um, but other than that, there will be plenty to see here. And as I say, I'm guaranteeing that there will be more Pep Organ content coming, just not weekly as it used to be. So that's a look into the future. Um, for now, if you're watching this when the video is out, then I'm wishing you a very happy holiday season, uh, whether it's up in the Northern Hemisphere and you're having, enjoying a lovely winter and, and nice cold snows, or if you're in Australia and uh, well, traditionally we'd be suffering quite a hot summer, but it seems to be pretty cold out there today, so we'll see where it ends up uh, by Christmas Day. For now, um, Thank you for watching, thank you for supporting Pep Organ, and a very special thank you to my Patreons, um, the patrons on Patreon, who are supporting me um, financially. That is a real great help. And if you're supporting me just by watching the videos, that's also a great help. Um, keep in mind that my revenue, as all YouTubers are, their revenue comes partly from their patrons, but then partly from ad revenue, of course, of course as well. Um, but ad revenue doesn't really add up to very much at all. So if you ever feel like you want to contribute to Pep Organ, there's also an option for the PayPal donations. Um, but I will leave that for now. You don't need to donate to me. I'm, I'm doing perfectly fine. But in the future, when I start doing these big projects, um, I think that it will be a really good idea to just show your support in any way if you enjoy the videos that I make. For now, thanks for watching and uh, wishing you all the very best.